involved, and so will be a number of key departments. Uh, and international there we go. De facto will be, will be out there front and center on it. Um, the, the, to the question of leeway, I think Richard's on to a really good point. Um, there's no going back to the days of departments being sovereign fiefdoms. So you're not going to have an all-powerful trade minister doing whatever the heck he or she wants, like C.D. Howe in the 1950s or some of these, or, or even a guy like Jim Kelleher back in the 1980s. What you're going to see instead, I think, is close teams that work very closely with the key people in the Prime Minister's office and with the Prime Minister. Message discipline has to happen. Uh, no one's going back to the days of people saying whatever the heck they want. Um, but the trick is to actually harness the energy of the individual minister and the minister's team and the minister's department and cultivate that and bring it forward into contributing positively while staying on message rather than something that a lot of people think happened with the Harper government or all that was just squelched in the name of message control. I can't and dome and do both fucking okay, things at one another, time. Um, expectation to do. here. Uh, Mr. Trudeau has said he would allow 25,000 Syrian ref and Iraqi refugees into Canada by the end of the year. Malaz Sabai is with Lifeline Syria, a group organizing Canadian sponsors for Syrian refugees. Listen to this clip. We're very thankful um, about the uh, pledges made by the government uh, really to um, increase the uh, refugee uh, resettlement here in Canada. I'm very thankful, but uh, we um, want to encourage them to continue with their expediency. You know, most uh, people Check don't know thumb. this. In October alone, there was over 200,000 people that crossed by water. And this is very dangerous. So we want to encourage them to continue moving at that pace because are, you know, hanging on by a thread. Okay, Richard Johnston, do you see um, uh, potential there for, uh, you know, can Trudeau deliver on his promise at, at the rate that um, a group such as this are now expecting? I, I think he needs probably to back off, and my, my reading of what I'm hearing is that he's sort of gotten permission wow. to be a bit Woo. more deliberate than the flat 25,000. I think he has to, he has to show